Today we'll be doing treatment for patella tendinopathy, patella tendinitis, anywhere between two and three bar is fine. We're going at 10 hertz. We've chosen three bar today because we want to get rid of some scar tissue. We're going to use a 15 millimeter convex head. We don't need a concave head, it's not too uh, deep, the patella tendon, it's just underneath the skin. We'll apply some gel to the uh, skin. It's quite common to do the treatment with the knee in this bent position. It might seem a bit unusual, but actually if you do it with the knee flat, the tendon can just dip in a little bit and it can be quite hard to keep the shockwave head flat on it. We're going to do this treatment in spots. So we'll do 200 shock spots around the patella tendon. You start the treatment and do 200 shocks on one area. When you've done that one area, you move on and do the next area. It's very similar to doing the Achilles tendon, really. And you just keep moving around until you've done all your shocks around the patella tendon. Patella tendon is a fairly big tendon, so anywhere 1,800, 2,000 shocks is quite normal. You just keep spotting around the tendon until you've covered most of it. You can do this treatment moving. Although the preferred method really is to do spots. See here we move on to another spot. And just apply another couple of hundred shocks. 10 hertz, it'll take quite a few seconds to get through 200 shocks. Again, onto another spot. And that will be repeated until the end of the treatment. 